Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I believe everybody heard about the big name of the Mid Journey, and this is a, a artificial intelligence tool that can generate amazing images. And people with arts and the design background prefer Mid Journey very much because the quality of the image is quite amazing. Look at all the images here. They are all generated by Mid Journey. And we can copy uh, the prompts to create a similar quality of the image by ourselves. Quite amazing, right? And they released the V6 version of the Mid Journey, which is most advanced uh, image generation uh, artificial intelligence. And this new model will enable us to create more realistic with more high qualities of the images. Okay, let's begin. Uh, first thing first, this website, midjourney.com, is able for you to open an account and uh, you can charge your money uh, to subscribe Midjourney membership. And if you don't have any membership and you don't have plan to pay any money to Mid Journey for now, this is okay. They also offer a free trial, but I currently I uh, subscribe the membership of Mid Journey already, and uh, it's cost me uh, some money, but I think I can handle it. Let's see. So this is midjourney.com, and I already log in, and I'm. Uh, currently on the tab of the Explore, and here is a, a subscription page. And currently, I'm on the plan called Standard, and this cost me thirty dollars per month. And we have a basic plan only for ten dollar, ten dollars a month. And we have a more expensive plan like Pro plan and the Mega plan. Well, I think this quite depends on um, what job that you are uh, working on and uh, your own um, story. And uh, do you use it uh, really quite often? So if you don't have uh, like very heavy work with Mid Journey, you can use a basic plan. Or I suggest everyone, when you try a new tools, always try free trial or the cheapest plan. Instead of a waste of money, I have a lot of membership of the artificial intelligence, but uh, they are all waste of money. But the military is not the one. But um, I guess if you are not uh, fond of it, then don't pay any money. Okay. All right. And uh, there are uh, some difference between each plans. And uh, in standard plans, we have... Uh, uh, 14 hours of the fast generation, so which means the speed of generates image will be faster than the basic plan. Okay, then we need to go to the discord.com. Uh, this is another website. and But this website is really popular, and I think you need to uh, sign up as quick as possible. The reason is many new artificial intelligence all use Discord as their platform. So Mid Journey, the website, is only for you to log in and charge your money. Uh, but actually, the work will be undergoing in the inside of the Discord. All right. So you can find the entrance uh, entry point of uh, Mid Journey Discord and accept the invitation. Then you will be landing to this page. Don't be panic. So this is uh, inside of the Discord. We have many channels already. I already booked many channels and um, we can click the icon in the very left side. And this is a mid journey channel. We click the little boat to find to enter the uh, channel. And they have uh, channels like uh, free trial. And in free trial, you can find a way to uh, try free, uh, try mid journey for free. And they are some channels like newbie, uh, 120, something like that. They can offer us you to generate image inside of them with free 
uh, free plan. Yeah. So after you try like 10 times, then uh, you run out of credits, you also need to pay money. Then come to a question. How do we set up a channel of our own and uh, use that channel to use mid-journey? Because we need a little bit privacy, right? We cannot generate image in front of everyone. They can, I don't know, steal our design. So uh, in the list of the users, we can see there are many users already, like thousands or hundreds of thousands, I'm not quite sure. But here is a very particular one. This is called Midjourney Bot. Basically, this is the only robot in this channel, and this is really matters. Then we need a, a private room <clears throat> that only <clears throat> belongs to ourselves, right? So click the plus icon to create a channel or server. Uh, they call the server. This is nice. And or templates there are you can already use, many but plans. I prefer the first one, create my own. And click here. And then click the for me and my friends. And then we can rename the uh, server. Let's try design time and uh, remove the server parts. And we can upload our avatar, then create. But avatars really don't matter. OK, so now we are in our private room. So we are only person inside of the room. Let's invite our friend, dear mid-journey bot. Click back to the mid-journey server and click the mid-journey bot. And then we will open the profile of the mid-journey bot. Now we click the add app. Then select uh, on the selector, choose our new room, design time, and click continue and check all the check marks and authorize so that the mid-journey bot can get access to all the um, capabilities. And then we need to uh, find the right answer. <laughs> That's quite uh, disappointing. OK. All right. Now go back to design time. And we, ha we already have our company inside of the room, mid-journey bot. Now we can use mid-journey. Finally, let's click the uh, box here and type slash imagine. OK, so imagine uh, is our major tools. Click here, then they have a, a small black box of the prompt where we can write down our prompts. Let's see our Asia man, 35 years old, with glasses. OK, now type uh, return or yeah, type return. Then mid journey start to generate the image. Now we can see they told us to waiting to start. OK, we got our images already. So we have a four at one time. Yay, four Asia man with glasses, which is better. I like a second one. So we can click here to visit the larger part of the image. And uh, we can check the detail. Look at the detail of the image. That's crazy. You cannot tell if this is a true, this is an actual person, or this is just a fake scientific uh, image. Uh, click here, uh, ask uh, Midjourney to recreate for more images. But I think the number two will do, right? So click U2. Then we will get the final version of this gentleman. And maybe we can use it or we can remove the background. OK, so now we have a V1, V2, V3, V4. V means variation. So if we like the number two, but we want to make a little bit change, we can click V2. But let's continue by uh, U2. So click here, open in browser to check the uh, the original image. Oh, that's fantastic. Look at the quality. Look at the hairs. Nice. And we can even upscale it. So we can totally upscale it to 200, 248 pixels. 
All right. Uh, I just need a little bit more time. And uh, usually within a second, let's see about this one. All right, it's working. It's under working. All right, so this is prompts can control of the images. So basically we need to go to prompts. But luckily in the midjourney.com, we have a thousand or hundred thousand of the images that we can copy. So no need to worry because the prompts are uh, good to use and we don't have a legal problem with using the prompts of others. And they all use a V6 because the V6 is new model, new mode of the mid journey. All right. I like this one. This robot is nice. Let's copy and I will use it later. Oh, we're down. So here we have a final version of our Asia man. I might use it as a avatar later. <laughs> Look at the quality. Look at the skin. This is a uh the best uh, quality of the image that we can ever get so maybe let's see if we can uh use this prompt from midjourney.com to create a dry uh robot and now it's waiting to start okay all right and uh, we can also browse other amazing works in midjourney.com while it's uh, generating. And maybe some can get us uh, more uh, inspiration, right? And some images are quite amazing. And uh, I'm always thinking about my work when I browsed it. Then, okay, now we're here. Check the quality first. Oh, which one do you like? Write down in the comment zone. All right, I like the first one, but uh, this time I will try variation one. So I need more vari variants of the number one droid, right? Number one robot. Okay, here we have uh, more um, more values in in the last part of the prompts, right? The mid journey added added automatically. Like this one, uh, with 6.0, this means this is generated by mode uh, 6.0. Uh, we can change it. I will show you how to change a different mode later. And then we can control the composition, the ratio of the image. Uh, I will show you later. Yeah. And don't forget to check to try the upscale, subtle, and uh, creative. Subtle means it's only changing a little part of the image, but uh, creative that allows mid journey to change most of the image. Then we have a like button. Okay, we're here. So all the four images are basically variations from variants from the uh, first one in the last uh, generation. So I like this one. Let's use U3. And let's upscale it. This time I will try creative because last time I already tried subtle, right? Okay, let's give uh, three seconds. It's getting faster and faster. How mid journey generates images is really crazy. Okay, it's almost here. I think it used to be like half hour when I just start to use mid journey. Let's give a thumb up and we can click your uh, right panel in your mouse and you can delete this image by click the delete message yeah if you find it's annoying you can delete and then let's type slash settings yeah this one and uh, return so here we can choose different modes so the recent one is mode uh, v6.0 alpha this is a new one and they join their uh, mode with a lot of the images like thousands millions i'm not quite sure and uh, then we have uh, another uh, selections called mode uh, v5.2 v5.1 
and then we can choose different style very high stylize very high high variation mode and uh, fast mode this is uh, my settings you can copy it and you can modify it you can try uh to change it to see where it's gonna bring you brings you right i i, I like this one and i don't like this one Relax mode with a turtle. Turtle usually means super slow, right? Yeah. So here we are, the final version of our dried. This looks really amazing. Check the check the size of the this image. It's like 2K already, right? Imagine this happens. This is a, appears inside of the clips of the movie. Crazy, right? Totally crazy. I like the qualities. All right, this is why so many people enjoy create images inside of the mid journey instead of other artificial intelligence because it's quite amazing, right? All right, let's find another one. This is time I'm I want to try something new, uh, more fantasy, more uh, sci fi. Maybe this one, yeah, this little girl with um. Uh, Iron Man Lish <laughs> Iron Man kind of the weapon Okay, click image and imagine type our prompts and this time uh, dash AR and uh, space uh, 16 po uh, and uh, 9 so this can control the composition of the image or what we call the ratio of the image because we can choose whether it's uh, 16 to 9 or 4 to 3 or 1 to 1 to control the composition of the image. So usually <clears throat> the movies will use 16 to 9, right? Okay, we got four different images already creating. Yeah, we can see the process actually. And um, well, it's... Uh, Processing. Okay, it's down. Oh, I want to. Uh, okay, so this little bit, uh, this value controls the composition. And uh, which one do you like? I like the second one because the second one looks more movie like. Okay, let's choose uh, second one by click the U2. All right, we got the final version, but let's uh, upscale a little bit. All right, I'm uh, upscaling it. Check the skin, it's amazing, right? Oh, look at the lips. So the V6.0 already been uh, training by many, many pictures of the humans. So that's why this picture looks so realistic. All right. Check the images. Each one's are amazing, right? Which one is your favorite? Let me know. You can write down in the comment zone. And also don't forget, uh, don't forget uh, subscribe us. Okay. Almost there. Let's hand in there. So basically we can control the image by type or click the button below. All right, this is the final version of our sci-fi like image. And we have a, 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 a little boy inside of the huge robot like stuff. Check the qualities, it's amazing. Okay, I hope you like it. And in the next episode, I'm gonna introduce more uh functionalities of the mid journey so stay tuned bye bye